Okay, we're going to put the speed fuselage together. Start it off, I have the the tail boom assembled. It's into the back of the fuselage. I have the uh, tail push rod connected to the servo but loose. Inside the speed fuselage, kind of hard to see here, I have the tail, um, the plastic pin that holds the tail in place just hanging on the screws right now. And that's the easiest way to do this for the moment. See if I can try to keep as much of this as I can in the frame. I need to slide the fuselage over and bring it part way up onto the actual airframe. Next we're going to have to put the tail case in. Get this to slide over the, the tail boom itself. The goal here is to not lose the plastic clip that's inside the case right now. So if I can get this in the frame, what I'm really trying to do is just get the alignment right so I can bring the plastic tail case, the tail pin, into the slot. And you're just going to have to work this around a little bit until you can get that lineup to happen. Um, and at some point move it around a little bit. It's going to have to go back and forth just a tiny bit. You'll get to a point where you can start bringing the screws through and that'll help you with the alignment. This is probably the most tedious part of this setup. The rest of the fuselage is pretty easy. Once I can get some tension on here, this whole thing becomes a little easier. And the goal is to get the the tail locator pin in place. And I found it's easier to kind of snug this up and then come back and do thread locker afterwards. As I start to put torque on here. I am starting to seat the plastic pin in the anti-rotation bracket for the tail. Now I can feel it fully seated there. So that completes really here. Now what we're going to have to do is pull out on the, the rudder push rod a little bit and I can Adjust the tail till it's out all the way, and you're able to get a pair of ball link pliers in here to complete this assembly. See if we can get this to line up a little better. Okay, tail push rod is on. Now what I'm going to need to do is go back and lock tight, thread lock these two bolts. Then we're going to take the side of the tail case off and go ahead and fish the belt through and we'll have this guy all set up.